The idea of the two-week G'day event in America is to talk up Australia. It's all about doing and creating business with a good bit of glamour thrown in as well. Well, they think Australia, and even here in Hollywood, are half a world away. Still, everyone's minds are on the floods and the victims. Devastating to see those tragedies happen all over the world, but especially in Australia. Yeah, it's really overwhelming. While Jennifer Hawkins was dropped from the show by Maya because of an ugly contract dispute, Jessica and Ash Hart, Pia Miller and other celebrity models were still there to walk the walk. Rav McManus, now living in the United States and still working on his Hollywood dream becoming a reality, was the host. To be here to celebrate uh, our culture, our food, our wine, our entertainment and our funny, funny accent. And one of the greats from the recording industry was honoured. Olivia Newton-John reminded us that Barry Gibb and the Bee Gees put Australia on the pop music map, selling more than 205 million records. This is a very humbling experience, actually, because... I don't think I've ever been so nervous in my life. Andre Agassi paid tribute to 74-year-old Roy Emerson, the great Aussie tennis player, winner of 28 Grand Slam titles, a legend still. Recognition, too, for a star on the rise, 28-year-old Abby Cornish. And rightly so, with the urging of Simon Baker and crew, the event also turned into a giant fundraiser for flood relief. The message from those here tonight, although far away, we feel your pain.